Hey fellow Jedi, I'm Mike and you're watching Force Within TV and today I want to talk to you about how to organize your X-Wing miniatures game tokens and uh, first up here I have a really awesome 3D printed organizer. I think I'll turn it around this way. You can see that it's got uh, room for your damage deck, focus token, shield and so on. I really like the fact that it has a the target lock separate. You got your blue and your red section there, so it's it's a great solution. Very easy to to uh, you know grab the target locks very quick um, to put things back in there as well and keep it organized on the table. Um, you know, as far as this goes though, uh, I use it around the host, like when I have people over or maybe when I go over to someone else's host, but I usually don't travel with it. Um, Currently, I'm using the uh, Creative Options um, case here. I do have a video review on this uh, detailing, um, you know, why I like it so much. Um, but basically, you know, I can't fit this in here. So it doesn't work. I don't find, you know, with traveling with this, it doesn't work as well. But uh, there is this smaller Plano case, which I have the target locks, you know, your focus evade, everything's in there and it fits in here. And, and this will snap up, snap up this creative options, you know, and then you're good to go. So um, it really, you know, it's it's up to you what you would like to have. Um, I'll just put that down. You can see the Plano case. Uh, very easy. It doesn't take up a lot of a lot of space. You can see the size of my hand there, right? Uh, quite small. You place that on the table. It's not going to take up a lot of room. You can separate your target locks. You got focus. Um, evades everything's there that you need except for maybe shields but you don't really need shields in here um, I usually put them in the larger case and then just take them out at the beginning of the game right so um, so that that is easy uh, I should just come back quickly to the 3d printed version here and say that uh, on eBay and I'll have links of this in the video description, but on eBay, you can pick this up. Um, it's got a top that comes with it as well. So if you do have, say, other than the Creative Options plastic kit that I just showed you, if you have something larger, you can definitely uh, put that top on it, take it, or even put this in a bag and, and away you go, right? So um, that's pretty easy. There's also another solution here that a lot of people uh, seem to enjoy uh, just looking online and that is a, a double-sided Plano tackle box um, you know you can keep your keep your target lock separate um, but I just find that one's just a little bigger it's a little bulkier I like the the smaller Plano case again because it, it fits in with my my bigger case um, and and whatnot so uh, a fourth option would also be just a, you know a little deck um, uh, if you're a card player uh, you probably have a few of these kicking around and it's uh, a deck case i should say not a, a deck of cards but it's just for cards and you can just throw your tokens in here and i mean this this really doesn't take up a lot of space on the um on the table right it's not the most convenient if you just have them sort of all in there it's going to be hard to to sort of find your different target lots uh, and, and whatnot but especially if you're just playing with two ships Right? you're not you're not going to have a lot of tokens or have a need for a lot of tokens so uh, this can be a good solution especially if you're going to a tournament and you know there's going to be a ton of people there and they're just going to cram people you know those three by three mats or whatever are just going to be crammed uh, right next to each other and you're really not going to have a little space uh, that's you're not going to have a lot of space is what i meant to say there uh, that's a good solution as well for those types of situations but um Always a good idea, guys. Uh, always a good idea to keep your tokens um, organized. You know, um, if you have them all over, spread all over the table. Um, I know some games can get a little intense, and you're you're trying to find your tokens. But if you have something to put them in, um, you know, you're going to be less flustered trying to find the right token. Um, you're going to be more on point with your game, and uh, you know, it, it's just I find it's a, a very respectful way. Um, to uh, come to a game with everything organized and ready to go because you know time is so precious to all of us right so be ready to go not to mention mention during a tournament right there's only so much time so making sure that you are organized and you have your um, you have all your tokens organized 
right? That's going to make you uh, look like a um, you know competent tournament player. It's going to help you feel confident. Uh, but your opponents are also going to really appreciate that as it is frowned on to take longer than you need to. Um, awesome, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Let me know down in the comments below uh, how you organize your X-Wing Miniatures game tokens. Also, all of uh, the products that I've gone over here will be linked in the description below. So please check those out as well. Thanks for watching. And may the force be with you always. Please consider subscribing, checking out my Jedi Train Like a Jedi series. Maybe check out a recent video. Or down in the video description, you will find several links to my website, including a table of contents of all the Train Like a Jedi series.